Junjun's just been offered a job and the salary he's been offered is $56,576 per year. But Junjun wants to know what his weekly pay would be. What we're going to do to figure this out is use the proportional relationship between uh, the pay and the amount of time. So we're given a pay per year. And let's take a look what that means. So over the course of the year, we're going to assume that there's 52 weeks. It's not exact, but let's work with 52. So Junjun's going to receive one pay, two pays, three pays, uh, four, five, six, and so on, all the way up to 51, and then a 52nd week of pay in this one year. So that means 56,576 is going to be what we get from 52 pays. And Junjun wants to know what one pay is equal. So there's a proportional relationship between the amount of pay and the time that Junjun works. So moving from 52 down to one week of pay, we need to divide by 52. On the other side, we need to do the same thing. So we're going to need to divide by 52 on that side as well. So one pay, one week of pay, is equal to 56,576 divided by 52, which is equal to $1,088. Let's just say Junjun also knew that he works 40 hours per week. And Junjun wants to know how much will he be getting paid per hour based on this same salary. We need to note that one week is equal to 40 hours. So 1,088 divided by 40 could give us $27.20 per hour.